Hey guys, Silverlord here, back with another unboxing. Moo hoo ha ha, it's of the Undead Element character, Fright Rider from Skylanders Giants. I have not done any other videos than these freaking unboxings for the past, what, three weeks? I, four weeks. I got one just before Halloween too. And I just... Come on. No, oh, whatever. Not showing that part of the set anyway. So, in my last vid, we unboxed a little old pop fizz. Now we're doing Fright Rider. His catchphrase is pretty cool. It's Fear the Spear. I hate ones that rhyme, but that one actually sounds pretty cool. Not compatible with the original game. Make sure this thing ain't gonna fall on me. Got the, it's got the bend of death in it, but it doesn't fall. All right. Um, yeah. Then on the back it shows him. That is an ostrich. I will say that. Then it shows him, Chop Chop, Hex, and Cinder. Because I did not re-release Ghost Roaster, the noobs. But uh, yeah, it shows the logo at the top. This logo at the top. Then you remember what? And there's the art. You will see it on the card in a moment. So let's unbox this guy. There was only one of these in my Toys R Us in the whole entire store. Well, someone had one. As you can see, I give, I doth not give crap to uh, the packaging. What did I do, stick fiends? So here he is. You gotta be careful with him. So I'm gonna do the little pullback trick so I can get him out. There we go. That was actually pretty easy. He looks really cool. He is another elf, but you know what? Uh, if they're good in the game, I could not care. These guys are basically like Series 2, except I don't think they have like a WoW Pal. That's basically it. They, they can still go to level 15 and cycle through their two, uh, two uh, upgrade paths. This one, I'm probably going to keep him on the combos. One of the combos, take him down that path, because I love combos. There we go. There we go. So let's take a look at him. Uh, he looks really cool. He's got his cool little evil freaking... I would not want these two sneaking up on me. I can't wait to get Giants to play this guy. Just hope he he, he should work. I, I checked them on the first game even though they don't work. They will give you the little message saying they're not compatible, so... He's kind of got a gladiator hat. I thought he had more of an elf. Thing, but he's got a gladiator helmet, which I like more than a little elf feather hat thing. But uh, this guy, he, he's kind of cool. It, he is this guy. The elf is Ryder, and the skeleton bird here is a uh, Fright. So they actually have individual names. It's not just Fright Rider. But I really like Fright Rider. He's cool. And his card, uh, attack of 80, defense of 70, speed of 90, and luck of 30. Well, his luck sucks, but everything else is good. I don't really give a crap about the other two. Yeah, 
And then it says Fright Rider. And then it shows his uh, box art sticker. And if you didn't know, his base actually glows in the dark. So let me see. Can you see it? Well, their bases glow up. They glow in the dark. I almost said glow up. Wow, that really sucked. Really sucked. So, like I said, here's one from Spire's Adventure. This is Hex, because she was in the front. And they have green base. The, the, the undead basically have the same base, I think. They have the same mold. For the most part. Yeah, but here's my Hex. My Hex has got a little bit of a black forehead, but that still kind of looks cool. It gives her an evil shadow look. She's got a skull. A little skull. She has a little skull. A little teeny tiny skull. Okay, you know what? Enough of that. And then it says undead on the bottom. Well, it shows a little symbol. I like how the undead symbol is just a derpy looking skull, and then you got this epic looking glow in the dark skull as the base. Wow, I didn't stick the stupid papers in the box. It's pitch black out, but I can still make videos in here. Awesome. So, uh, yeah. That's about it for uh, Fright Rider. If I had to rate him, I'd probably give him a 10. He looks pretty beast. <laughs> If I, if I can say a word, he looks pretty freaking beast, but, uh, I'm gonna do what I did with the other two. And, uh, give you something to look at while I'm BS. <laughs> I actually need Fret Rider's box for a moment. Come on. I'm just gonna stuff this in there. Hope it works. There we go. There we go, that worked. Yeah, but I have to say, out of the eight new characters, the standard characters, these are my favorites. My top three would probably have to be these two and Jetvac. Because he's an eagle with a vacuum. You can't top that. I don't care who you are. The only guy who can top that is Santa Claus. We all know about that. Just saying. Move the camera over. But uh, you're probably wondering, what does old Overlord want for Christmas this year? Ah, well, let's see. Uh, ooh, ah, ooh. Where should I start? So, uh, what do I want? Let's see, I want gargoyles. More gargoyles. Even more gargoyles. Maybe some more gargoyles. Okay, you know what? I'm not just. It's not just gargoyles. Okay, guys. <laughs> they might be my second life, but I like. I like modern stuff too. Even though most of it does not apply to me. It actually looks like he's charging on his base. That looks cool. But, um, Transformer-wise, I basically asked for two Viacons, Decepticon Rumble, move this over a couple times, Decepticon Rumble, uh, who else? Crap. Knockout, Dead End, Dreadwing, and, uh, Starscream, Transformers Prime. I'm talking Voyagers and Deluxe class here. No leader class or whatever. Weaponizer, whatever the free they're calling them now. 
I, I don't like the weaponizers mostly because they're too big in the back. Especially Optimus. He looks like he's going camping, but whatever. They're kids' toys. What can you do? But, uh... I'm gonna move him over a smidgen. That works. But, um... What am I thinking of? That's about it for Transformers Prime. Maybe the Terracon Cliff Jumper Toys R Us exclusive first edition, but uh, that's about it. They did re release Starscream first edition too, so I might get that one too. I haven't seen any first edition Voyager, so. But uh, another thing I. Now we're going into Ben 10. Uh, we, I would like Eagle, Kick and Hawk, Jury Rig, and Spider Monkey. Basically, the new four that just came out. That they shouldn't be too hard to get. I mean, my dad could probably go up to Toys R Us and find four of them, all four of them. I'm not expecting those. If I don't get them, I'll just go to Big Walmart and snag them. But, uh, uh, what's the next thing? Hero Factory wise, I only need Stormer XL and Speed of Even because I'm gonna get Bulk and Breeze in the next couple of weeks. Along with uh, Cyberverse Skyquake. So, Hero Factory, I only want Stormer XL and Speed of Demon. And also from LEGO, I'd like a couple Monster Fighters st things. That's about it. And then Skylanders, these two were on the list, but I bought them today, so I'm just like, oop, I gotta cross them out now. <laughs> and then, uh, let's see. Skylanders, Giants, I want all the Giants, so... I want, I want the starter pack, obviously, with the new portal, so I don't have to keep buying batteries. So that would come with Tree Rex, Jet Vac, and Cinder, so less toy hunting time. Excuse me, sheesh. And, uh, the Giants. I wanted Bouncer, Hothead, Crusher, and, uh, Swarm. What else? Crap, I'm running out of time here. I wanted Sprocket and Flashwing, and then Lightcore, Hex, and Jetpack. Those are basically the regular singles, and uh, little higher priced singles. Hopefully I can get Terrafin and uh, Lightcore, Drobot before uh, Christmas, so I'll probably get those too. And what else? Video games besides Skylanders, Giants, uh, probably Transformers, Fall of Cybertron, maybe Halo 4. That's about it. And then CDs and music. Uh, Ice Earth, Dark Saga, and Testament Formation of Damnation, because those are some cool albums. And probably Disturbed and Destructible, I'll probably put that on when I go fix my list. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing and I will see you all uh, in uh, the next video which should probably be a mm, weekly update so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, I will see you all later